So check this out. Here you go. Jane. Is this thing ridiculous? <laughs> Look at this. It literally has no scales. It feels like human skin. It's a ball python. It's called the scaleless ball python. What a name, right? <laughs> Today, I'm visiting a friend, Miguel, from Always Evolving Pythons. Wait until you checked out this collection. Hey, I'm back. Come on, yeah. let's go show me your snake room. Let's show go. everybody your snake room. Here's the cool part. Ball pythons don't take a lot of room. So how many how many snakes you have in here? 400. How many world's first you got in here? Honestly, probably like around 20, Whoa! 20 to 25. Somebody yeah. besides me is living the dream. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> try to, try to. I'm going to start off with one of my favorites. So check this out. Here you go. Jane. Is this thing ridiculous? <laughs> Look at this. Now tell me. What's an inchy, okay. inchy clown? Spot nose, red stripe, yellow belly. Yeah. Dang, is that thing crazy? Check this dude out. Girl, look at that. Now I don't know how good that looks, but it's literally like a ghosty looking color, but of course it does have ghost in it. Yeah, <laughs> GHI Mojave ghost, 100% head clown. Like I said, these are ball pythons and they're still pythons, but these come from Africa. Basically a small python that don't usually get over five feet long. I've seen a seven footer, which is psychotic. And they eat basically rodents. They're not, that I've seen big ones eat rabbits. <laughs> so that this that is, to me is one of my favorites right so here. The, now this is, look at this. So basically it's a G, GHI Mojave, which is basically like a, almost a panda pie. Here's the funny part. Look at the tail. Completely different. Is that cool or what? To start out black and white basically on the front and then end up with Orangey cool color in the back. You didn't have an odds for one, right? Dude, the odds is one in 24th chance and to one get one. One in 24 and you got yeah. how many eggs? I had uh, five eggs and we hit three of them. So there you go. Yeah. Living the dream. We got so lucky with That's this That's living yeah. the dream, man. 100%, That's yeah. That's crazy. <laughs> now this is kind of a unique snake. I don't know if you can see it. It literally has no scales. It feels like human skin. It's called the scaleless ball python. What a name, right? <laughs> Definitely not for a beginner. They're a lot of work. No. And and you know what? And a lot of money. It's kind of weird. They got a, yeah. a little, because there's no scales, they all meet in the middle. Kind of funny. And anyway, a pretty darn beautiful snake. The only ones that are in the world. This one. Oh, That's I forgot right. about this yeah. one already. That Look one. at the orange on this snake. I got to make a retick with this color. Yeah, no, I didn't make this one. I actually had to purchase this That's one. That's okay. I wish I could have made that bad hey, boy. But you know what? You're living the dream. You can yeah, afford 100%. to purchase it. No, you can afford no, to purchase You're right. It. You're <laughs> well, anyway, absolutely gorgeous, amazing animal. Oh, my so word. Sorry. Look at that. Look at this. It looks like fake snake. Okay, yeah. I can, you know what's funny? I've been doing snakes for 35 years, right? I don't have a clue what's in this. I have to look at a label. Yeah. So it's the chocolate and the butter that makes that weird gray. Yeah. Well, if right. you don't know what a butter is, which most of you are it's probably like lesser, going, right? what are all these names? A butter is basically a different lesser that was found in the wild, but it was called butter because the original person that had lesser was like, you can't call it a lesser because this is the only lesser and this is, you got a different snake. Anyway, amazing snake. Check this out. The starboard snake. Oh, Here yeah, that's snake. And look at that. I mean, talking about a snake that should be called creamsicle. Woo! Just an I mean, lesser. Clown. Just an clown. Oh, put it, you got to put lesser in that. I know. Would it, would it work really good with that? I I was going to make them, and I didn't, and yeah. Yeah. They, they would be epic. Hold on. There's, let's talk about one that has a lot of uh, jeans in it. And that was this is another world's first. Ooh, look so at the, that one right there. Look at the color on that thing. Th so this is a male? Yeah. That's my so, whole back. So here you go. So this is how... I, on a ball python, they're really, really easy to sex. Same with retex. You can actually see those are his two hemipenes. Now, after he breeds once, those will triple in size. So this is this has never been bred. No. Yeah. Imagine putting these two together though when they're ready wow. for age. Look at the colors. Look how clean this head is. That's super clean. All the patterns super clean. This one is too. Yeah. Here's one. So here's the crazy part. This snake's shedding. Look how clean. All the Here's pattern is on it. Oh my goodness. Look at how clean these snakes are. They look fake. They like hand painted. It's literally like incredible. We're gonna make another video and we're gonna ultrasound snakes. Yeah. Okay guys, hope you enjoyed the video. Again, this is Miguel from- Always Evolving Pythons. Yep, and we're living the dream. Living the dream. Our style. He does a lot of other things. You gotta see his car collection, it's pretty bad. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he has lots of dreams, just like you do.